absolute righteousness right here. Boom. Okay, just make sure everything's good. I think it is. Right. Welcome to This Week in Bungie. <laughs> this Week in Destiny. New Season 18 Deep Side Focusing. The first time players focus a season of plunder weapon each week with the double perk. Uh, actually, the focus weapon will now also drop with re uh, Deep Side Resonance. Downtime. Which just happened, so we don't need to worry about the downtime right now. Nightfall. Cool. Right. In we go now. Um, to the helm to see what this week in Bungie has got for us. This week in Destiny. Why do I keep saying this week in Bungie? <laughs> ay ay ay. System. Level seasonal shaped weapons to level 10. What, bro? Are you fucking kidding me? That's gonna take years. Holy shit, that's gonna take so long. Just for some repute, like. Hold on, I just need. To, you know, actually, fuck it, I won't delay. I'll just get into the story stuff. In case it's gonna be a long. Dream. Glad I caught you, Guardian. I didn't want you setting off after Aramis without a little warning first. Oh? What's that look? You don't survive as long as me without being able to smell trouble. And honestly, kid, you stink of it. You've been cutting a swath through those pirates out there, but don't get complacent. Mm. Watch your opponent, but watch your back, too. You're going after chunks of a dead disciple of the witness, and you've almost got them all. That's some serious juju. The stakes are high. That's when folks tend to get unpredictable. Oh, Drifter is alluding to something. He is 100% alluding to something. To be with Season of Plunder weapons in Expedition. Oh shit, I don't, have, I don't even have any Season of the Plunder weapons. Uh, actually, first let me just, like, do that. Oh, did I? I must have done, no, I did those ages ago, I'm pretty sure. Right, okay, we can focus... Oh, but we can't, because I don't have that. It was... Which one? With an extra perk. This one. So, the first time you focus Season of Plunder Weapon each week, you roll with an additional selectable perk. But now it also gives you a deep sight every time, every week. But now I need to find a Season of the Plunder Weapon, because I just delete all mine. Oh, that's going to be annoying. So, defeat, combatants defeated with Season of Plunder weapons in Expedition and Catch Crash grant additional progress. So, it can be anywhere. Hmm. <gasps> Wait a minute. Our saving grace! We actually have the ability to just pull the weapon straight out. Hold on, what's my uh, heavy like? 72. Oh, 73. That's higher as well. Bro, this is why you saved this shit. And that's the tomb. 73. That's not higher. But a heavy isn't going to cut it. I just realized just there, so. Right. We've got our weapons. Now we go into expedition and go from there. Oh, we're only rank 50 now, seven weeks in, like, I just realized. No, oh, I didn't mean to open that. Oh, well, actually, you know what? I, I got it exotic. I can't complain. And it's gone to the postmaster because I have too many. Okay. Oh, did they have to sell this now? Fine, I'll get it. I can't not get that. 
Okay, right, sorry, enough orgasming. Let's get to the actual story. Um, expedition. Oh, it's actually Arc Singe? Bro. That's pretty good. Oh, the dungeon should be... What is the dungeon? Prophecy? Yep, it's Prophecy this week. Don't know if I'm going to do it, but like, just to let you know. I kind of feel like deleting one of the shells just for this. Because, I mean, it's kind of cool. But, again, I just don't know if I want to go through the effort of leveling it up. You know? Especially with the amount of glimmer I have. Sorry, castaways. I will keep that sword there until, like, I need to get rid of it. But that won't be any time soon, honestly. Right, so now, because I have two Seized of the Plunder weapons, this should not be that hard. <laughs> God, it's so weird coming in back into a game like Destiny after playing a bunch of different games at a bunch of different frame rates for so long. It's almost hypnotizing, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, <laughs> I didn't even <laughs> think that was an enemy, like. That's how fucking blind I am right now. Oh, there you go. Jammer, I like jammer. Oh, I can fit. No, I can't. I'm trying to be too speedy. Oh, Jesus, Joe. Come on, just your fucking get there. Will make your precision, shot more precise. <laughs> precision shot more precise. Gotta love saying. You know? Even though he doesn't really have much to do with this season, I love that. that he's just, like, in the background anyway. But then again, Saints, like, tie right now is like, Osiris will most likely come back at some point. And that is basically public knowledge as well, because the fucking Lifefall, like, promotional images literally shows, like, Osiris, like, coming back, like. At least in the thing. Twenty-six, okay, so I might as well just look at the end of the activity and see what we get. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, of all the sidearms, I actually don't mind this one. Okay, hold on, let me... Oh, sorry, you're getting that one. Okay. I can smell a big score nearby. Bring down that cabal. Big score? Where at he... Another one? Bring down that cabal. Oh, bro, did they just... Were they just spamming these guys now? Just because, like, we haven't finished thing yet? Bro, where are all these champions when we needed them, like? Uh... Yeah, okay, Spider, I'll do what I can. Or Rezix, I think his name was, or something like that. Oh, yeah, it's because the sidearm's fucking synergizing with me. I was like, why the electricity? And I briefly forgot that Arc 3.0 is out, you know? 
Could you imagine if they actually said, you know what, here's like more stasis stuff? Like, that would be mad. I don't think they would, but still. A okay. Oh, come on, please. I'm so close. There we go. He dead now. Uh, okay. Tro thing, Joe. The only thing this sidearm is missing is more ammo. Again, I can't overstate how nice it is to look at actual frames on the screen again. Ow. Being a bit lazy right now, so I'll just do that instead. Okay, I got 90 of 100. There's no way I'm going to falter now, like, right? Did that give me one? Okay, I get it now. I need four more kills. Okay, I think that was it. No, never mind. Yeah, I still need, like, at least three kills. Uh, 96, okay. There we go, now I'm finished. Apologies teammates, but I will be progressing the encounter. Oh man, bro, I was I was gonna beeline it for the uh, catch and try and get on it, or not catch the skiff. Damn, how did you not fling me halfway across the map, mate? Wait, where is he? Well, first I want to pick up that, then I want to do that, I'm gonna do that, and then I want to try and find there he is. He's not a champion, but he's a high-leveled enemy. Damn, that reload, though. Sheesh! Oh, man, if I was a bit closer. And a bit more patient. You know, I kind of want to actually craft this, like, sidearm now. I'm not going to lie. Again, I can't, like, overstay how beautiful it is to be looking at 60 frames on my end again. Uh, but I'm going to probably play some other games soon. Depending how fast we get through the story bit. It looks like we'll actually get through it pretty fast this week. Just because I uh, had weapons in the season pass ready for moments like this, definitely. Damn, that poor guy got decimated, like. He got decimated so hard that a challenge of mine got completed, like. Oh, I 
love the Beyond Light soundtrack. I keep saying I like this soundtrack, this soundtrack, but to be honest, I kind of like all of the soundtrack of Destiny, like, a good portion of it, like, a good lot, most of it, 99%, like, maybe even 99.9%. There you go. But we are going to use this newfound wealth to help the people of the city. Complete pirate hideout. We will use it to turn the LXD quarter for a refuge into a home. Say so we're doing that. Just let me go here. That was last week's one as well. Pretty handy. An er engram. I mean, I got a thing last time. I don't know if they fixed it in the thing notes, but I want to wait and see to see if they actually did. Because Bungie did address that they are fixing quote unquote bright engrams, but I don't think they gave a like timeline of when they'd actually do it though. My hopes is that it's soon, you know? They don't just leave it forever. That's 73, so it actually needs to stay. You can be deleted though. You're a fun bull. Not that much fun. Yeah, go on. Use a glaive for once, Joe. Actually, can I use something else? There you go. Oh, matter wave. Guardian, you face an LXD skilled in scrap working. Her name is Ethix. Ethix. I have engaged with her before. I doubt her tactics have changed. She hides behind traps and shanks and believes herself clever. She will not face you if she has a choice. Leave her. So, the trickster, but less ballsy. Right. <laughs> you just knew I had to give it a try. Someday at Bungie was like, okay, it needs to be this amount for it to work. Like, Nah, it's just a random light on the thing. Is it? Yeah, it is. I thought it was like a dead ghost for a minute. I'm like, wait, I haven't seen those in ages. I know they had like a few dead ghosts in... Uh, I think it was like Forsaken or something, but that's it. Like, But not as proper collectibles, I don't think. Hmm. Feels weird going through this with like actual enemies inside. Bypass code fragments. Oh wait, that means I need to actually collect something. Hmm, I wonder if this is the guy that has the code. Very curious. Wow. Oh. oh my god, there's actually quite a bit of them. I wanted to, like, take the moment to change my weapons again. Because I just realized I don't have this on. Oh, I already... Oh, okay. We don't need Thundi, though. <clears throat> no damage, by the way. Cracked. I'm actually, I'm not going to lie, I'm getting pummeled here. <clears throat> it's really just the tracer shanks that are really doing me in right now. Oh, there. Okay, when they said, like, she hides behind shanks, I didn't think it would actually be a whole army of shanks, like. I haven't seen anything but shanks. She really doesn't trust anything else but Shanks. <laughs> See, that time it worked. I should have kept my swiftness. Yeah, so this was the one time where, like, the enemies were already dead. And there's reason the same place now. Oh! She's literally. Oh. <laughs> I fucking died. 
Can I get a do-over, please? I think that's the first time I've actually died in a pirate hideout, just because I was actually legit cut off. Right, let's try it out again. Oh, there she is. Oh, you're, you're okay. <laughs> Epic. Oh, are they moving into the lost sector? Oh no, never mind, they're just camping here. Damn. You really be taking that much damage, aren't you? Oh, I thought I had the slide. If I had the slide, that would have looked so cool. At least to me. Sorry, excuse me, come through. Right, there's the code, yo, to put in. Right now, not really a code, yo, you just hit the thing. Yeah, you're not really gonna move from here, I'm not gonna lie. Never mind, you have moved from here. Oh my goodness. The amount of shanks just getting gunned down here is not nice. To them. It's very satisfying for me, though. Come on, punch her to death. Don't take that out of context, please. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, right, got another one. The old crews fear you. Fear us. They know they cannot stand in our way. Spider wish to speak Looks to like you. Captain Kells found his inner pirate again. Perhaps it is what I am. And Erebus speaks the truth. Hey, now, I didn't say that. What's that Ido said to me? Aramis will fight forever to get rid of her shame. Maybe you did that for a while too. But then you made a safe place for the Elixni. That's what Aramis wants. And she'll never get there. What we do now matters more than who we were. The Drifter speaks kind truths. Miserax thanks you. Hmm. Good words, brother. Couldn't have said it better myself. Ah, uh, you're missing a bit of the gravelly voice, you know. Transmat firing. I know I can't do the drifter impression, but I still love to do it anyway. Oh wait, what are we on? 53 to 62. Oh, so... No, wait, yeah, Joe, there's still a few steps. Probably next week. I don't know why I tried to keep convincing myself as if, like, it's not gonna end, like... Until next week. Hey, you know what? Until then, we keep going. Oh, have you seem a bit unrest. Fortnite Battle Bus. I just... No, Joe, don't finish that sentence, please. I need to remember to put the relic away. I always need to remember uh, to do that. Oh, are you... Oh, you guys are fixing it slowly. What about Aramis? Good of you to visit, Captain. Oh, what's up? Seems like only yesterday I loaned you my ship. And now you're known across the system. Flashy. Not my style. It's safer in the shadows. I learned that long ago from a handsome young fellow named Rakis. Your brother? He served the old crews for a time. Got double-crossed. Spent the rest of his life running. Or is that you, Rakis? 
Eventually, some would claim the bounty on poor Arrakis. He called himself Spider. <laughs> oh, this thing's fucking moving. Savvy? Cast in the past, bought a future. Walked away, reborn, and never looked back. Oh, so that's why you're going by a different name. Like Mishrax, pretending his old life never happened. Oh, he's changed a bit over the years, but the old fury is still inside him, somewhere. It's best he not forget that. Could have you to visit, is that how nice? Yeah, so again, just recap the thing. Right, how are we fucking you over this week? Are you fucking us? Ah! Let's go. Hmm. Spider barely reacts as you pull a powerful reward from the engrams. Lucky draw, Guardian. Go introduce it to some pirates. I'll send up a flare when I get new engrams in. He turns away and busies himself with the supplies. It's strange, Guardian, says Ido's voice over the radio. I have no energy surges to report. My instruments are working perfectly, but... There was no recent interference attempted the, from the ether tank. I am unwilling to speculate as to why, but I am pleased things appear to have resolved. <laughs> Just like constantly cooking over spiders as much as physically possible. I do enjoy your Didn't I not get like another quest there? I swear I got two. No, never mind. I'm, I must have imagined it. Ah, uh, glimmer. 56 and 62. And I make the demands. And then that's just that. Okay. Right. We have two more little lore bits to listen to. Not much conflict this week. Actually, very short. How long did that take us? Nearly half an hour. Scribe log Zeta 7 AD. At this point in the Guardian's adventures, we have had contact with a great many pirates. Each crew has a unique composition, pledges loyalty to the most powerful among their numbers. They fight for whomever promises them the most power, or the most glimmer. They adopt whatever code of honor befits them, and concern themselves with little beyond the present. A friend told me that these pirates are not as free as they seem, that their lives are fueled by desperation more than their own desires. But there is still the call of the open stars. These pirates sought to possess the relics of Nezarek. What else might they hold? Oh. I greet you in the light. You are young and honor the old ways. So I will speak gently. You say there are paths that never end. But these are also paths you cannot turn away from. Mizrax thinks he can. He is wrong. He and I will always be what we are. But we are not something you would wish to become. I remember the whirlwind. And we are running from it. We are running from that pain. And will be forever. You do not want this life. Aramis. Do not stand in my way. If we meet again, I will be the last thing. Sheesh. Okay, then never mind. We have some uh, tensity now for next week. Again, it would be pretty cool to see, like, um, Mithrax and all that stuff maybe become a guardian. Who knows? Maybe with fucking Nezarex, like, pieces all combined, like, He'll, like, be detected as a dead body by a ghost and he'll get revived as a guardian or something. <laughs> Just another guardian. Unless... Because, like, some people say he was a guardian, but other people are saying he's, like, a different being. I think he was a guardian, right? Unless... Nah, actually, it wouldn't make sense, would it? Because why would a guardian be a disciple of the thing? But then again, anything's possible. Right, let's listen. Oh, yeah, so you can even clearly see the space here. There's two left. Records. 
But most of the primary sources from that era were destroyed. What we know from second-hand accounts is that Nezarek led the Witnesses' first assault on Earth, or oh. as humans call it, the Collapse. After the Great Machine repelled the attack, Nezarek's pyramid crash-landed on your moon. Beyond that, the sources are vague. They hint at a process for harnessing the Relic's power, but give no instructions. If we could replicate this ancient methodology, there's no telling what we might accomplish. That's interesting. So, Nezarek was actually one of the people who actually led the attack with, through his pyramid, their pyramid, um, initially when the collapse first happened. And his, uh, the pyramid on uh, the moon crash landed. Obviously, that's why it's under the like surface of the moon right now. Because it's been buried over, like. Wait, that's 73, I don't... Is there? Hold on. Well, my current come to pass isn't that, but... Yeah, no, we'll leave it. Um, yeah, I'm actually surprised to say, but that's actually it for this week. There's nothing else here to mention, other than just getting this as well. I was like, wait, well, how, how did I earn that? I can't remember. Ah, yeah, no, what? Screw it. We'll open the engram and get our blue. Go on, Joe. Go do it. Waste your engram. I fucking knew I'd waste it as well. Another ghost shell. Like, three ghost shells in a row. But to be fair, one's from the past. But two are from bright engrams, though. Like, um, Yeah, I have nothing else to prove here. Right. Um, hmm. Okay, let me exile Destiny. I'm not even going to do prophecy this week. I'm not going to lie. However, I am going to look at... Hmm. Am I going to look at? Because, uh, honestly, I don't really feel like playing Slime Rancher 2. I don't really actually feel like continuing streaming, honestly. I think I just need to recharge my battery for today, so... Uh, yeah. Um, before I go, though, a little, uh, a little sneak peek to an upcoming reveal for Sherry Arbor's story that I thought I'd just show here whilst I have the chance now. <clears throat> and it's going to be weird because you think like, oh yeah, I would have never thought that would have needed this, but here it is. Sherry Arbor's story finally has its own logo now. It's been so long in the works, like of making this light novel series, but finally I can like at least have this logo temporarily like showing the series you know and honestly looking at it more now I, I'm starting to like it a lot more but anyway a video should be coming out on that soon I think that's what I'm going to do now I'm going to stop streaming and make the video in relation to this uh, and then I will also say that from now on future thumbnails with Sherry Arbor's story in it like uh, will probably include this logo somewhere I don't know where but we'll have to say I might have to redesign some thumbnails and stuff but anyway Thank you so much for watching the stream. If you liked it, obviously like it. Comment if you want, subscribe if you want, and hit the bell if you do so desire, and if you're watching this on YouTube as a VOD. But if you're watching this on Twitch, make sure to follow me live, and, you know, we can hit more follower goals, and you can also keep up the speed of when I actually stream, and maybe not accidentally dox myself. Let's go. And, uh, yeah, thanks again for watching, and goodbye.